Hey guys, it's Kelly. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Bath and Body Works haul. I'm sitting on my floor in my room. <laughs> it's nighttime. It's almost time for Lego Masters and I need to get this video filmed because I have a couple more packages right there that I'm trying to batch film. I'm trying something new and I may get a little uh, overwhelmed. So I made a Bath and Body Works order. I needed more wallflowers. I needed more refills. Uh, I needed more shower gel. And I'm wanting to decorate for Easter. So I didn't get any candles this time. But I'm going to just go in and go ahead and show y'all what I got for Easter. It is a uh, candle ring. I got one for Christmas. Uh, not last year, but the year before in 2018. And it was like a champagne gold. And I got uh, the egg one for Easter. And I am obsessed. Uh, yeah. I'm wanting to get into like. I don't really decorate for Easter because I'm not religious. But um, I do have three kids who enjoy Easter egg hunts and getting their Easter baskets. They know the Easter bunny's not real, but it's still fun to share with my kids and they know about what Easter is about. Does that make sense? They know what it's about, but we just don't celebrate the religious aspect of it. I also made this order because the Bath and Body Works was doing the um, buy get two free if you make a purchase so the things that were free were the bahamas passion fruit banana flower body cream and um fragrance mist and i had to get them because i i love tropical scents they're are my favorite so we're gonna take a sniffy sniffy and this is the only lotion that i got and the only fragrance mist i got so Mmm, that smells good. Yep. Can't really smell the banana. It is. Banana trees gently sway under clear blue skies. Passion fruit blossoms fill the air. Grab a bungalow and bask in the beauty of this tropical fruit fragrance. Passion fruit, pineapple leaves, and banana flower. This smells so good. And the packaging is like super freaking adorable. So here is the fragrance mist. It is just a plain. It's not a shimmer, which let's see if it. Mm-hmm. Yep. Like my fave. So I'm so glad I made this purchase. At first I wasn't going to because I have a ton of lotion and a ton of fragrance mist. But eh, what's one more? It's not gonna hurt. And I also got a new wallflower plug to go with all the refills. And it wasn't one that was, uh, you buy a plug and you get a free refill. I didn't do that because I didn't like the offers. But I had to get this one because it's me. It's Mama Flamingo with her baby. And I have three babies. So if it had like three little baby flamingos, that would be fucking perfect. But, yep. I would think this is me and Sammy because Samantha, my oldest, she loves flamingos. So I think she's going to get a kick out of this. And yeah, I'm just. And it's a nightlight. So this will be going into our kitchen for the summer. I bought two six pack um, refills of the wallflower plugs. So I think the this one is uh, coastal. Uh, I'm gonna have to look at the. Hmm. Da, 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 da. Coastal wallflower or island living wallflower refills. You got pineapple colada, island margarita, passion fruit, banana flower, the same scent as this. Oh, I hope it throws good. Ocean driftwood. I don't really. Oh, there's two passion fruit bananas. Ooh. So, okay. And they look like they're different colors. One is a pink and one is a blue. This one I don't think is a... 
because it's got a different color top and huh I was about to say if they were the same if it didn't throw it well into my kitchen living room because it's an open floor plan I would put one in my bathroom and see if it throws in a smaller area better and then the last one is a mango mai tai which is another favorite scent of mine I'm going to have to do a video of my favorite wall, my favorite scents for wallflowers because wallflowers are a hit and miss. You can get a good strong scent and it'd be too strong in a small area, but it would be nice and perfect in a big area. And then you'll get a light scent that is perfect in a small area, but non-existent in a big area, if you know what I'm saying. So if y'all want that video, comment down below and let me know and I will make one. And the second six pack that I have is the fruity wallflowers so i got black cherry merlot which is another favorite uh midnight blue citrus sun wash citrus which i love citrus scents but that one it smells more like a musty uh board if you know i my husband works in construction and i it smells like old sawdust in my opinion uh, mango dragon fruit island papaya that's another light scent that does not throw well and then watermelon lemonade another light scent that works better in a bathroom or a bedroom and not in a open floor plan kitchen living room and to end this haul I got six uh, shower gels five for me and one for my husband my husband he uh, uses like three and ones and he always buys his at Walmart and so he has two right now. And so he wanted more of the mahogany woods and Bath and Body Works retired that scent. And it only comes back every once in a while. And when it does, I stock up. But uh, the scent I got him, and he's already busted into it and freaking loves it, is the Atlantic 3-in-1 uh, hair, face, and body wash. I think, not last Christmas, but was it his birthday or the Christmas before? It was either one or two. Um, my mom, she got him the Ocean, which is up there. Right there. The Ocean Body Lotion. And the Body Wash. And he's he was okay with the Body Wash and he's not using the lotion. Only when his hands are like really, really dry in the winter, which... His hands have been really, really, really cracked lately. And so he's using it on top of his work stuff. But, yeah, he loves this. He likes it better than the ocean. And I like it better than the ocean, too. I thought about keeping it for myself. It was that damn good. Another scent that I've never tried, but I've always wanted to get my hands on and just never had. Because I think it's retired. And that is Forever Red. Um, I've never smelled it, so I might hate it. But every time they've brought back retired scents, I've just never went for it. I don't know why. There was always other scents that I wanted to try. And I was on a budget, and I had priority scents over certain ones. So... Ooh, I'm mad at myself. This smells so good. Oh, yeah. Yep. I'm going to have to pick up more of this. It is fiery pomegranate. I love pomegranate. Uh, rare French peach. Luminous apple. Red peony night marigold. Red osmanthus. What is that? Oh, I got to Google. Rich vanilla rum, velvety marshmallow, and oak wood. Oh, yes. This is now a top priority scent. <laughs> I'm just going to have to make a video for me and for y'all of the best scents that Body Work, Bath & Body Works does. Because I'm going to need this reminder and to share with you guys. The last four are new this season. So I got Saltwater Breeze. Again, a beach scent. I love my beach scents, so uh, I got 20 minutes till Lego Masters comes on. Do y'all watch that? It comes on Fox. Will Arnett's the host, Lego Batman. Okay, so let's 
Take a snippy. Okay, uh, fresh linen, violet leaves, water blossom, and white musk. I don't know. I may grow on it and I may hate it. So, I always, whenever I do a blind buy, like I always do with Bath & Body Works, the scents I don't like, I always give to my mom and she always likes them. We are polar opposites. Uh, I remember one time I got Into the Sun that thing that line that they did that one summer and it smelled like san suntan lotion and I could not stand it and so I gave it to my mom and she absolutely loved it and she gave me a different one which was uh it had a bronzer at the beach yeah I loved that one and she didn't like it so yeah uh sorry for the light it's gonna it's skitsy but yeah I don't know. The packaging is really pretty. It's like a blue gold marble. I'm sorry you can't see it because of the glare, but yeah. I don't know. Maybe I'll grow on it. Maybe my mom will, will get a nice gift for Mother's Day in two months. So, And the next one is Confetti Cake Pop. I had to get these because the packaging is just so freaking cute. And this is Creamy Cake Frosting Rainbow Sprinkles and Vanilla Bean. And so, let's sniff this one. And also, if I don't like any of the scents, my kids get them. Mm. That's a lot of vanilla. <sighs> I think my kids will be getting this one because I'm not a big vanilla fan. And that has, my, that has me about to sneeze. Um, yeah, so my kids will get this one. No, mm -mm. I don't. I like vanilla is not my favorite. I like the scent of it lightly, but not heavy like that. That was just too much. Okay, so the next one is margarita cupcake, and it's got oranges and limes. So I'm hoping that it smells very orangey. Because I love citrus scents. And it's got key lime, sunny citrus blossom, and whipped vanilla. Oh my god. So much vanilla! Can't handle it. Ugh. Okay. Mmm! <laughs> yeah. Okay. Smell the orange. And then underneath I can smell lime. Yeah. So, this one's mine. Mm-hmm. <laughs> margarita cupcake and it smells just like orange and a lime I don't smell any vanilla at all and then all of these body washes they are aloe shea butter and vitamin E so, okay last one and yeah Addie might fight me on this one because it is strawberry pound cake the kid is obsessed with strawberries and she'll probably come in here in a moment going like <gasps> strawberries and so, <laughs> let me open this. Okay, so I got it open. The notes are fresh strawberries, golden shortcake, and whipped cream. Sounds good. I want a strawberry shortcake now. You don't, I don't smell strawberries. I smell whipped cream. And it's a little tiny hint of strawberries, like, underneath. This is, yeah, this is all whipped cream. It's like, once you open up a pack of um, shortbread or shortcake, like those little cups, it smells like that with the whipped cream. No strawberries. But I'm still keeping it. Even though my kid might fight me, I don't care. So that is it for my Bath and Body Works haul. I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, I don't do Bath and Body Works hauls as much as I want to because I take my time on this. All of this costed me $132.15 and that was with a 20% off discount and I think free shipping. 
No. I paid shipping. Yeah. No. Okay. Uh, it was $132. I got the buy three, get three on the shower gels. So I got three shower gels for free along with these two items for free. So the wall plug, the refills, three shower gels, and the Easter ring that added up to $132. So Bath and Body Works is expensive and I do shop there occasionally like at the beginning of the year and sometimes in the summer during the semi-annual sale. Um, yeah. I hope you enjoyed this video. Comment down below. Have you tried any of these scents? What's your favorite? And uh, maybe convince me to try it. If they still have it. Don't send me any retired scents. So, please give this video a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and comment down below what's your favorite scent, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.